What's going on, guys? It's your boy, Beast Mode Always, because I'm always beasting. Back again with another tutorial. Now, I was going to wait until Tutorial Tuesday, which I call Tutorial Tuesday, to come out with this tutorial about lag or connection speed or better connection for uh, to improve your online gaming. Um, the reason why I had to do it today, guys, because this was a problem that has been affecting me for the past couple of weeks. Um, I wasn't able to upload or even play the game yesterday or day before yesterday because of it. It's been a big issue. And guys, if I have a problem, I'm going to try to pretty much share the issues or the solutions or the fixes for the problems. Now, I don't know all the technical terms and all that stuff for it, but I do know what helped me um what worked for me or what improved my game uh, what helped me out um in my situation so i have no problem with sharing the knowledge to you guys now first of all let's start from this all right lag we all know uh what lag is we hear it all the time a guy might be standing in place his legs moving he's skipping all over the place okay but what if the game seems like everything is working well but your bullets just not hitting the person or you get uh, the, the um, uh, detection your hit detection is just not um, it's just not seeming right just the game just not seem fair or right some of the things you can prevent but some of it you just can't some of them you just can't sometimes you're in a bad lobby uh, the host is just terrible uh, you can't you, you, you just can't you know predict and stop some of those things unless you have a certain type of router the net doom or whatever where you can pretty much pick who you want to play with and how you want to play the people got a certain type of ping uh you you pick people that closer servers to you and all that stuff with a net doomer but everybody don't have that so i'm gonna try to help out with the situations okay my situation what problem that i've been running into was uh, the past couple of days, I've been running into situations where before I even turned around the corner or before I even, you know, came into a situation or came into a certain vicinity, people are already seeing me. They're seeing me before I see them. I had one situation where I'm walking up the steps. Guys are already seeing me at the top of the steps when I wasn't even at the top of the step. So certain things like that is lag compensation. Um... And I have very, very good internet. My internet speeds are very, they're like in a 100, 200 megabytes per second. Um, they're up there. So why, if I have speeds like that, why am I still having a problem? I will put it to you like this, or and this is the best uh, scenario or metaphor that I can break it down to you. Let's say that you have a car like the Beast Mobile, which is a Challenger. Let's say you have a Challenger and let's say you have another car which is like a let's say a, like a toyota four cylinder toyota it's not that fast okay even though that challenger is very very fast the more people you pile in that challenger is what it's going to do it's going to slow down that challenger now the challenger is rated to run and be very very fast but you have so much going on in that challenger that it's going to bog it down or make it run slower until you get all those people out the challenger now if you have that challenger next to that toyota the more people you put in that challenger next thing you know that toyota is going to be able to outrun that challenger because it's weighing it down so that's the pretty much the same scenario with your online connection so in my situation what i had to do guys what i what i found out that helped me was i went in my router and i tried to find out what was all connected to my router now i didn't know this that i had 10 different devices connected to my router guys and again this situation was my situation it may be your your situation it may not be but i would say if you're having a problem with the game or you're not getting good connection speed you're seeing something wrong with the game check your internet check your router she was all connected to it everybody may not just can just go in on their router and guys i'm not giving you no technical terms i'm gonna give it to you raw in the purest of form if you can go inside your router and see what all you have connected i had no idea i had 10 things connected to mine 
So now I got 10 things connected to my router and I'm trying to play the game, which is an online, fast paced multiplayer game. And we all know these games are very fast. If I have 10 things connected to my router, it's gonna slow it down or not give it the full potential or the full function that I need for it to do. So it took me at least a half a day to try to figure out all this stuff that I had connected to my router. So I say that to say this to you all, to you guys. If you're having uh, problems or if you want better connection, I ain't gonna say if you have problems, if you want better online gaming or you're looking for better speeds or just, uh, uh, just uh, better gaming, start by going in your router um, I don't know if who's your internet provider. It could be Comcast, it could be AT&T, whatever it is. Google how to go inside your router and where you can see what's all connected to it. You may have to ask your parents. I don't know, ask your wife. You know, whoever you need, you need to ask. Just go on that and look at that first and see. You may have some other things that's connected to it that do not need to be connected to it. If you game at a certain time where there's a lot of people home, try to figure out who's all connected to it, what's all connected to it. My situation, I had printers, I had computers, I had tablets, I had phones, and these are devices that were not, all of these devices were not even being used, they were just sitting there. So even if they're sitting there, they're just connected to it, they're taking up all that signal that don't need to be. So another thing that i would recommend for you guys to do is better if you're hardwired with the ethernet it's always better you're just going to get a better signal a better connection everything is going to be um faster and better because you're hardwired you're getting a direct connection from the motor or the router to your playstation so i recommend to be hardwired if you can if you can if you can't cool what you want to do is get the full potential, get the full function for the Wi-Fi. And what I have, I've researched and I've Googled and I looked into a lot of things. And I would recommend, guys, go to your network on your PlayStation where you can set up your internet connection. If you're Wi-Fi, go through the steps and where you see... Uh, it's a it's a function where you see it says custom or easy pick custom now when you go to custom you're gonna see IP address settings and all that go to automatic but when you go to uh, the next phase DHCP host name go do not specify when you go to the DNS settings pick manual now what you're gonna see is primary DNS secondary DNS on primary DNS pick 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8 and on the secondary DNS, pick 8.8.4.4. Now, before you do all this, I would recommend you do a couple of speed tests. Do about four speed tests. When you do those speed tests, write it down. Then I would recommend you connect your, uh, go to your uh, browser on your PS4. Go to your browser on your PS4 and do another speed test because the speed test that you do from the PlayStation itself is, is their estimates they're not really accurate um, go on your browser and do a speed test write that down once you're done with all that then go through the steps and do like I said go to the primary DNS change that to 8.8.8.8 .8 the secondary DNS 8.8.4.4 and see what those speeds are and see what that does for you um, I've done that and it helped me out a lot everything is not perfect every game is not going to be the same way and some games yes you have some lag some different lag some lag more than others but i have noticed that my hit detection has been a lot better my the way the game flows and moves it itself is a lot better everything has been moving a lot smoother and i would recommend guys trying this you have a lot of people that's saying do this saying do that i'm not saying to do this because it's going to work i'm saying to do this to try it because it may it may help but if you want better online or to improve your online gaming 
this could help you guys out if this was a help in any way guys make sure you hit that like button make sure you comment below and if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe this your boy beast mode always yeah.